Enhanced weathering is the acceleration of natural rock weathering. As the rock weathers, it captures carbon and locks it in for thousands of years, and it can be used and accelerated for use on a global scale. This beautiful rock is basalt, a mineral-rich volcanic rock that forms when molten lava cools. The basalt we use is an existing product of the quarrying sector, so we aren't using any additional energy to procure it. By spreading it locally, using existing farm machinery, our operations have a 95% carbon efficiency. Basalt is also one of the most abundant rocks on Earth, which is helping us scale up our operations. The crushed basalt we spread is zero to four millimetres, so a maximum particle size of four millimetres down to a really fine powder. By increasing the rock's surface area, carbon dioxide is captured approximately 50,000 times faster than in the natural world. The silicate rocks we spread are tested to ensure they're always safe. Carbon dioxide is the greenhouse gas that we need to get out of the atmosphere. And during the natural biological cycle, the carbon dioxide ends up in the soil as a mild carbonic acid. The basalt captures it, turns it into bicarbonate ions, and these are washed out to sea. We're taking it from the biological cycle into the geological cycle, and this is what we're excited about. We're now at Muir House Farm, just outside Carnwath, which is an organic dairy farm. They're receiving some of the enhanced weather and finds from the quarry today. The finds will help for crop yield, soil health and pest resistance. We utilise the, the local agricultural community whenever we, we spread the enhanced weather and finds. We use local contractors, local hauliers with good reputations to make sure that we, we keep the money in the local community. Because we're using local contractors, they feel more comfortable taking the enhanced weather and finds. We're helping to lock up CO2 and also the farmer's getting a, a good degree of nutrients and trace elements into his soil and help to improve his soil health. We've been working with the organic certification authorities and we've had this material certified for use on four of the leading organic certification bodies. There are three parts to modelling the carbon dioxide that we lock away. One is the analysis of the rock dust. Using precision instruments, we know exactly what's in the dust. Number two is we use this data to model the rate at which the fines break down as they react with the carbon dioxide that's dissolved in the water. And number three, we use full use of GPS technology so we know how much carbon that we're using in the haulage, in the spreading, and also how much we're capturing it. We process this information and we can calculate how much carbon dioxide we're locking away for thousands of years to effectively help create a net zero future.